Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back, Day Tari Hour. As always, I'm here. Akit is here. Akit, and this here is Azrin. <laughs> <laughs> we are back again for another episode of the Day Tari Hour. Hour. We are back after a, a break on Christmas. Yeah. Christmas break. Christmas break. But we are back again. We are on our schedule. Coming back here. This is uh, our last recording of the year. Two thousand two three. Two thousand two three. Our last recording, but this episode will go live on the first of January, two thousand twenty twenty four. Oh, we survive a year. Ah, happy New Year. Happy New Year. <laughs> Even though we, it's not New Year yet, but we will be New Year soon. <laughs> yeah, today is not New Year, but uh, by the time you watch this, it will be twenty twenty four, and we will usher in a new year of uh, hopefully more 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 fun stuff to do along the line lah. Yeah, I wish you all, all the people, all the audience, and have have a happy new year and have a weekend, and then uh, Hope we have I a think two I think a two o two four for everyone also is a new chapters for everyone's right. Yes, that's uh, it's a beginning of another new year. Yes, hopefully a better year. Mm -mm. For some people, uh, some more to next year is a dragon year. So for yes, the year of the dragon for the Chinese mm -hmm. New Year, but that starts on February, right? Mm -hmm. So, <coughs> well. We're back here. The first episode of the year. We should we want to do something about more on ourselves rather than our usual talk about other other things. Well, I mean it's talk about other things, but it's more like this episode mm -hmm. we want to review how was 2023 for Malaysia and for ourselves as a channel law. Yeah. I feel like um 2023 was a quite exciting year uh, uh, for in Malaysia, to say the least. Not just to say the world, uh, the world quite quite happening also. Uh. Yeah, the okay. The if let's say for nations, maybe a lot of war or some some well, other places, yes, right? Uh, there's a lot of uh, big things happening. Uh, in the the Palestinian uh, and uh, but which come, is still ongoing. Yeah, and, uh, ongoing. But come to Malaysia, the big things uh, happen in Malaysia. I think so. Uh, the government already announced that one thing is called Madani. Oh, Madani was this year, right? Yeah, Madani. I thought Madani was 2022. Eh? Madani, somehow, he got the support for some uh, some people, the citizens, so called 100 ringgit. So that's why it's so important. Oh, the, uh, <laughs> actually, not everyone got that, you know. there's a There was the issue of some people not getting it and, and whatnot. But yes, that was one of the yeah, one of the things like big, your big, big thing big So everyone also got big the benefit. big benefit for everyone. But also, and it's like a lot of problem with the benefit, you know, because like oh, you can only use it for certain things, and then you want to in order to claim it, you have to have certain level of uh, income, or yeah. you need to do your taxes already, and all this thing. <laughs> Maybe this is the first uh, means the uh, the foundation is give someone to uh, give for the the some people in hundred ringgit maybe later on Madin Madini maybe give Madani you give you uh, uh, to five government five hundred or three hundred or maybe more <laughs> how we know I mean if <laughs> if government has the money to give it then okay lah you however it is lah but yeah handouts was uh, actually not as much lah it's that Madani one and then uh there's a lot of uh, rah rahma rah Rama packages and all this thing, mm -hmm. uh, the five ringgit, five ringgit meals. That was this year, also, right? Yeah, five ringgit meals. Uh, and then what else in Malaysia? Like, what? but it's very dear. Unfortunately, la, Malaysia, the thing is everything is night hunger. <laughs> but it's give you a give you a hunger ringgit or some meal is five ringgit also. But the thing is. Economically, uh, eco economically uh, our country wasn't that great. Yeah, the, all the thing is a uh, night hunger. Even you will, nowadays, uh, you go to eat the the noodles or whatever. Next year, they'll increase the price. This year, they remain the same price and then next year will increase the price. So, yeah, you give me the hunger ringgit, but in the end, the Everything hunger ringgit... Also, <laughs> it's not worth it. Uh, no worth it. <laughs> <laughs> I, like I said, you can go to the five ringgit rama. <laughs> five ringgit rama, what, what? what? Actually, what, what inside the, the, I mean, the... Con the content depends. Uh. So I think like so the, some of the mama that does it is like one rice, mm. one meat, and one veggie, and then one drink. But the size, the portion, I don't know. La. Maybe it's chukuk chukuk. The only, nasi lemak know? portion. Uh, the uh, nasi lemak like pungkus. Uh. I mean, I see also on social media like the 499 nasi lemak uh, or what. <laughs> got, still got this thing. <laughs> so it's not too bad, I guess. But like economically, we weren't doing so great. We had the whole big uh, 
uh, Malaysia currency compared to Singapore, which was yeah, uh, exactly. one of our biggest video in, uh, in the year. So if you haven't watched it, please watch. <laughs> <laughs> please watch our videos. Uh, yeah, the the ringgit runto. Yes, uh, Singapore three Sing- times better than our our three point five. Ah, yeah. three point five better than. than but now Malaysia it still really. remain. Huh. <laughs> it's it still remain three point five, is it? And then look, turn a bit lah, three point four well, something. At least uh. we never reach four. Okay. If we reach four, uh, then there is a <laughs> U, uh, US dollar. La. US dollar. Better we just go US uh, at this point. You know, <laughs> right? I mean, like Malaysia e- economically wise, is like in 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 the in our country itself, right? Mm-mm. We only feel the the rising prices only, right? Mm-mm. But when we, I don't know, uh, a Malaysian, uh, did Malaysia do a lot of traveling in twenty twenty three? Traveling. Uh, I think uh the traveling I know is one thing is uh the the visa we are we are got the we no need any visa entry China. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. So oh, this right, will yeah. increase the 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 people here you go to China but for travel. We also did the opposite. We we have stopped giving uh we we stopped requiring visa for Chinese people to come here. Mm. And also other countries as well, right? Uh for China people they come to Malaysia is 30 days. Uh. 30 days on eh, uh. not 3 months. Uh. 3 months way. Thirty oh, days. Thirty days only. Yeah. Uh, uh, we we went. We going to uh China is a uh, fourteen days. Uh, two weeks only. But that that shows that we are trying to you know Anwar is making move to 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 connect with other countries uh, You know, yeah. building building the foundation right now, right? The the, we, the we, PR we with relationship. This, this year we attack Anwar too. Much. Well, I attack Anwar too much uh, because of his. <laughs> 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 not only not only in terms of economic uh, uh his financial uh, abilities as finance minister la. Mm-hmm. but also the fact that some some of the cases like uh, Zahid uh, mm-hmm. corruption case being dropped yeah. uh, and then uh, apparently like uh, oh another uh, political scandal is uh, what's his name the Sheikh Sadiq oh, Sheikh Sadiq kena, kena jail yeah, it's very the muda, the muda, what well, the muda opposition, chairman opposition opposition uh, if you're in opposition in 2023 uh, some of you will go to jail <laughs> But so, so Lang Chai, you don't see yeah, so, I mean, he's still young, lah. Still young, young So I guess it's not too bad, lah. Eh? Mm-hmm. Uh, I mean, okay. Let we're we're talking. We're 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 going all over the place in terms of like Malaysia twenty twenty three in review, lah. Mm-hmm. But let's let's talk about our personal uh opinions and how our our experience in Malaysia for twenty twenty three. Like for you, right? Mm-hmm. Throughout the year of twenty twenty three, how was your feeling of Malaysia at uh during that time? Optimistic, uh, uh, very sad. Uh, how how was your twenty twenty three of Malaysia? Twenty twenty three in Malaysia, I feel like it's very. I mean, I feel very lucky also in this twenty twenty three. You you come out you're feeling very good, is it? No, because you know in Malaysia you can see a lot of the cases of the, the the corona the the virus things right. The Cor- coronavirus, COVID, uh. Uh, COVID, everything is happening in Malaysia currently also lah. So I'm very lucky. I'm still here. I'm still alive. Okay, but between like- <laughs> of us, also alive. And then we are have a job in Malaysia. And you know, you know, Malaysia a lot of people is jobless. And then, um, so we are still alive. And then this, uh, I thanks God lah. I'm still here. I'm I'm, I'm very peaceful and very sad. Heart. I mean, okay, that's that's <laughs> your your personal uh, opinion of how how you feel in Malaysia, mm. right? Like, if you were to give a performance review for Malaysia in twenty twenty three, what would it be then? Like a grade, ah, uh, you want to give a grade to to Malaysia? The grade to Malaysia, uh. uh if let's say great in Malaysia, I think it's still got the room for improvement. If let's say <laughs> for great, always, always, uh, uh, got the, always uh, got the room to improve lah, but. This year not too bad. Our GDP also increased for Q1. Yeah, okay. Increased. Here's the thing, right? When we say GDP, right? What does that mean? Okay, we we say oh GDP so good, right? But you, I feel like wow, you as a, okay. you're satisfied because the GDP is GDP increased. Is good, but do you do you experience that that increase in GDP? Man? How 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 that that? But you feel you? good, and then because you read this news in the paper. Yeah, but. Like, <laughs> But there's no material, actual material <laughs> proof that GDP increasing is good for you as a con- as, as a citizen of Malaysia, leh. Like tangibly, like real thing, like what 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 thing made you better in when GDP improve? 
Oh, nothing to me. What? Like your salary go up, ah? No, ah. <laughs> but the salary go up is very personal, ma. Right. Okay, but like, what, what, what influence your salary? The economy, right? Mm. If the economy is good, then your salary should be good also, right? <laughs> <laughs> or is it when the economy good, your boss' salary is good, but your salary is <laughs> normal? <laughs> but f- you, you cannot combine everything, sir. Uh. If let's say you combine, uh, it's very hard to, to give a, a, a grade, you know. That's why you need to be like, uh, we need to look at it like, okay, when you say GDP is good, right? Like, okay. That's the ec- economic indicator ma, that the country is doing good, right? But at least got the n- good news. Oh. You know that uh, our GDP is grow and then uh, at least our governments had do something and then they have, uh, what you call that, uh, they are also in, uh, invite some of the uh, foreign invest to come to Malaysia for invest like Tesla, uh, these kind of big boys to come to Malaysia. It's some kind of like, you have feel like, oh, positive, feel positive a bit because they read the paper. It's not saying in the government you see the parliament uh, Mara here and Mara there and uh, do the nonsense thing. I cannot wear the short pen. Uh. This thing will be so negative to you to listen. Uh, every day I, uh, I open a newspaper and say, oh, I cannot wear a short pen in Langkawi. And then got the quarrel in the, oh, cannot wear short pen. Uh. The girl wearing the, the short pants to go Langkawi or this kind of thing. Make a conversation uh, co- with the controversial this thing and then just the, on the paper. Then, then, then are you grading this based on our economic uh, performance or are you, are you ignoring the, uh, uh, do you take into account the social, social things happening in Malaysia in part of your grading process? The economy, la. at least you can see the, where you can, the, the investor from, from overseas. But again, this is the thing. My, my thing with it is that you, you look at the investor and all this, but like the, does the benefit translate directly to the people? Eh? In not in, actually indirect, okay? You call it indirect. You feel like, oh, feel good. And because I heard the, the, the government. It's a feeling. Uh. <laughs> the feeling. <laughs> la, the government feeling, are doing something. It's uh, doing something, mm, have doing something to work up on something. But it, when previous time you can see the parliaments all that oh nothing they're doing nothing you feel like oh so disappoint so at least they listen to got something I don't know whether it's good for in 2024 it's not no matter it's good or bad lah. but I still heard some news from there it's good some, news. some uh, movement there uh, movement la. so okay then, then overall what, what will you give the, the final grade for Malaysia in 2023, their performance review, if you are the boss of Malaysia, technically you are la, because you pay taxes, right? <laughs> so you are considered a... a, a I said B already, ma. Huh? Oh, B, ah. uh, B already. Oh, B, ah. B or C, this kind of level, it's still got the room for improvement. The improvement a lot actually, it's not... A, just not a, a, a great one <laughs> anymore. A lot of improvement you see, ah, the education <laughs> reform la, and then what are they, ah, economic... La, all that, this kind of thing. La. I believe in a lot of things we have to improve. I mean, of course, definitely. Like, uh, I mean, okay, like, I would say mine is more lower in like C minus or C la, in terms of like your grade. La. My grade towards Malaysia. <clears throat> because uh, economic indicators, like you say, your GDP, all this thing, uh, and then all this in, uh, investment yeah. prospect from, from, uh, from Anwar, where he, where he say like, oh, we just recently secured Japan trade investment like billions of ringgit, yeah. right? Uh, it's not then, my business. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something is kind of, it's not my business. <laughs> but it's, it's, there's uh, like, oh, economic investment and also Tesla coming in, uh-huh. which is uh, we consider a big thing, la, uh-huh. even though I don't really like Tesla at all. <laughs> but whatever. Uh, and then the US, we, we go to US, but we still you know uh, uh, manage to criticize them about Palestine, all this thing. Yeah. Economic indicators is one thing, but it doesn't necessarily translate to the people receiving that benefit because as we all can say, honestly, if you are Malaysian, 2023 might not be the best in terms of financial uh, prosperity, la, mm-hmm. right? Uh, our, our inflation gone up, mm-hmm. uh, interest rate gone up, mm-hmm. things are more expensive, mm-hmm. and your salary might not be on par with what should be paid your salary might not reflect the living cost of Malaysia, Mm-mm. right? And also, we still have people who are, uh, let's say in Sabah, Sarawak, they're some of the poorest state in the country still have this kind of po- uh, problem, no? right? Hey, okay, I... And that's just economic thing, okay? 
social factors, of course, it's still a, a work in progress. Uh. The, all this LGBTQ, mm-hmm. uh, anti-phobia uh, and all this thing. Uh, and of course, you already say like, uh, oh, our, our cabinet, all this complaint about people wearing shorts, uh, all these things. Mm-hmm. And we, we have made some uh, uh, progress in terms of like, uh, you know, giving Malaysian citizenship to, to children who are, mm-hmm. who, who still uh, like, if you're born, yeah, born in a, overseas. A woman, uh, mm. a Malaysian woman, you automatically have the uh, ability to have a citizenship. There, mm. are, these are some improvements that we are making, but it's not as good as it should have been. Especially when we have someone as like Anwar who put himself as a, uh, 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 what what's it what's it, uh, what's that he always say he's a rebel you know, revolutionary, the progressive. What's that word he he always say that he's a like a change. He, he will do all Informacy, the... what? Ah, reformacy. Ah, reformacy. There you go. What is the reformacy that we have experienced so far? What what constitute the reformacy? <laughs> ah, <laughs> like you, you cannot like at the top of your head. What is what has Anwar done that is reformacy in the sense? Now I understand we if only it's only been one year, right? Mm-hmm. But as far as I can tell, the reformacy has always only been just reformatting the cabinet. With people that Anwar <laughs> prefers, that's all. <laughs> I think the first thing the reformacy should point out is the corruption. Well, that's that's not being reformatted at all. <laughs> the corruption is a lot. So, I think it's uh, after independence, sixteen years, our M, <laughs> this guy, Mr. M, uh, uh, Mr. Conduct the Malaysia, Mr. Co- conduct Malaysia is because of these uh, corruptions. I think we we are mark more. We are prosperity. You mark more. Yeah, you, you know, see, it's 19s and uh, tw- 2000, yeah. But this is uh, not the right pathway to go there. La. I mean, like, okay, like, <laughs> I, I feel like we still... Honestly, I don't know if I, if I even want to give it a passing grade. La. Could be like a D plus. Uh. D plus. <laughs> C minus, uh, falling, falling. Like, I feel like the economic uh, 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 good things, mm. the news, good news of economic things is not enough to... to you know, cover up all these like things that are uh, affecting the people yet. Lah. So personally, mm. I feel like Malaysia in 2023, my review is not so good. Lah. Not so good. Lah. But it's very lucky you're still here. Yeah, some people's like, seriously, because we're surrounding a lot of people is very bad lah, because of the sickness. Lah. And then you, we are lucky here, we still can. <laughs> but is it lucky, lucky because of government or no. in spite of government? And because we are li- we are still here, we are can still can fight for the government. That's what I'm saying. Like my 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 review is for the people who cannot have a voice. You know, <laughs> I am the voice of the voiceless. So for the people who are dissatisfied with the way that our country is moving is like, yes, there. It's it's. I feel like Malaysia now is much more divided than ever. Uh, we have a ton of issues that we need to deal with. Mm. And, and so far, all this like uh, economic prosperity that we're talking about, we still have not seen it materialize for the people. Uh. It's like, I don't see how, how the benefit is translating. But I can see some impro- improvement. Uh. Seriously, I can see. Of course, see. there are improvements, but that's the thing. The, the improvement is okay. marginal, very small. Yeah, very small. But uh, I... I just reasons uh, I went to this uh, Kot- you know Kotaraya right yes, the Kotaraya yes, yes, yeah. site there I see the infrastructures and some things uh, they do they do quite okay com- compared with last time la. it's all a, bl- a bit of off okay, la. I say like satisfied comparing, la. comparing it to what comparing it to COVID time or comparing to like I don't know 2018 maybe after before 3-4 <laughs> years back la, before COVID la, the, the the way they say the, the people do business is very Lesser and pe- lesser people now is more crowded. The people in uh, I mean the in the in the Kotaraya side there. Is this just because we are uh, the past gram? We just uh, want to shopping because we've been stuck for two three years. That's why <laughs> I have no idea. But it's still the infrastructure there also have have do some work lah. The infrastructure you can see the the pedestrian areas and all that. I still yeah, not but bad. Then again, <laughs> is that is that actually systemic changes or is that because of the Election. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes the election. I put this one is because the election. But it's a good thing nonetheless. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind lah. At least go right. At least sometimes the the pothole got the cover la. <laughs> But Never see. never end one the pothole. <laughs> Only every four years minus five. <laughs>
that's why I'm I'm not gonna give it like an F lah because yes, there's still some good things the government has done lah. Like I said, the one hundred ringgit benefit lah. Mm. Uh, but I, you you got the one hundred lah. No, because you no know, pay tax right. <laughs> no, I pay tax uh, I I pay tax. You rich. My get <laughs> my salary is definitely not the the level cut off, but. I don't know what's wrong because a lot of people also got that same issue and I'm too lazy I to also, go through. I, I just applied from Maybank. I think Maybank, the e under under the... Yeah, yeah, uh, I did. But they never explained why why you don't get it. That's a problem. I don't know. I also not get it. I tried to <laughs> click a few times also, but in the end, yeah, you're not know, clicking. Yeah, also, I don't care. La. The government head out also cannot get so susa. <laughs> okay, but, la, for Malaysia, so Malaysia, the conclusion? Oh, the conclusion is... For Akit's grade is B or C. Mm. For my grade is uh, D. D or C. D or C. Okay but la. I think I lean more towards, towards D la. More to D. Mm. I'm more to uh, C la, actually. Really? Uh? <laughs> <laughs> say, more room I, to grow, my bro. I already, already convinced you to show lower. More, more room to grow, you see. Okay, then here's the thing. What would make, what needs to happen in order for you to give Malaysia an A+. Plus? Wow, this question uh, very good. Uh. Like what, 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 what's the thing? Uh? You say, oh shit, Malaysia did this. Uh. Okay, we are. This Malaysia very good. I give you A plus already. A plus. Uh. When Malaysia achieved the level as in Singapore. <laughs> <laughs> we, you know what's funny? Uh? We know, no need to go Singapore you know, $3.5. You, you know what's funny? I was about to say the same thing. I was going to say my, my, my indicator of like the uh, Malaysia getting an A plus. Uh, if our currency is one to one with Singapore, yeah, <laughs> it's, in the end it's like that lah. <laughs> okay, there is one lah, but the other thing for me is like having social benefit lah, better social benefit, mm-hmm. like something like a uh, no more student debt or uh, education is free or healthcare is free. Like that is a wow, that is S tier yeah. or A plus plus lah. Some like Europe, ca- Europe European country lah. Yes, mm. but of course people won't agree with that because if you get free healthcare it means you have to pay more taxes lah. So I don't think people will agree with me. Lah. But seriously, now the the medical f- medical fees like in Malaysia is quite cheap also, you know. For public. Mm. But the thing is, we are lacking doctors because doctors are not getting paid properly. Maybe we we should hire more AI doctor or <laughs> how to how do to that. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, now AI. Or well, maybe just pay doctors properly. The you know? nurse is a good AI. We, oh, welcome. Where, where, where did our tax doc- money go, man? It's going to building more highway. That's why. <laughs> shopping mall. You need to see a shopping, shopping mall. Shopping mall is different. <laughs> or, 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 maybe TRX considered under government spending. I don't know. <laughs> <coughs> so yes. So, so for, I guess for us, uh, the only way for Malaysia to get A plus is for us to be same level as Singapore. <laughs> <laughs> same level now. Then okay lah. <laughs> Uh, well, actually, one point five one dollar uh one dollar to one ringgit fifty cents. I, I also well, satisfied. Well, at least a, a one and one lah. Uh, one and one lah. Not one and three uh, or one and four. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> That's. <coughs> but if I'm being honest, I don't know if we can ever achieve that lah. That seems like a. A plus what? You see this? Your A plus student is very less, you know. <laughs> 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 wow, love it. Your quality is so bad, man, in Malaysia. <laughs> no, la, we're, not taking it, we're not talking shit about Malaysia. La. We're just saying uh, that these are the things that we can hope to improve on. La. Yeah, the room is there. You know, B and A, A, A plus. Three step to go. Oh, three step. Uh. Uh, three step to go. <laughs> oh, is three, mine is four uh, because mine is D. Uh. D, C, B, A. <laughs> three. Okay, la. okay we uh, stop with the nonsense. <laughs> So I mean like okay, so that's that's Malaysia in review twenty twenty three. A lot of things happened. I mean we can't really recap everything that happened. Of course there's so many things. If you want to uh learn more about the things that happened in Malaysia and our opinions, go watch all our videos. We have a <laughs> whole year <laughs> content of videos. But that's enough about Malaysia. Now let's talk about ourselves. But before we do that, we're gonna take a quick break and we'll be back in just a few.